Hi, so on Plasma, the 25th anniversary edition, we actually removed a couple of features that many users liked, the flip and cover switches. So if you didn't know what those are, we'll get into it. And if you did know and use them, the first question that you might want to ask is, why did you do that? Well, there were good reasons to do that. Basically, we are redesigning the way that KWIN desktop effects were. Before, they were huge C++ files that were very hard to maintain and use. However, now there's a nice QML port that's being brought up, both for the present windows and for the flip and cover switches as well. So none of these are ready. The present Windows one is being actively developed and hopefully we'll get it in the next release. That's the hope in here. And as far as the flip and cover switches go, well, I never actually use them, not a big fan, but when I saw the work being done on the new one, I went, wow. So if you never use them, well, take this video as this is a new feature that might come into the next Plasma releases. So basically, what are switches in general? You can change the way that you can see all of the windows uh, that you have open while you are switching between them. It's in the Queen settings and there are various to select from. The default one is Breeze, which is like the left sidebar. There has been some proposals to change it to thumbnails, but it went nowhere so far. We also add the flip and cover switches. Let's see the flip one and it's this. There are some minor issues with animation and stuff like that, but you know, that's why we haven't shipped that yet. And then there's also the cover, cover switch, which looks very nice. And I gotta say that I'm really, really a big fan of the blurred background that they have. And also the 3D look, it's pretty convincing. And I honestly really like them and I hope they will be integrated into Plasma very soon. As pretty as they look, uh, the developer developer told me to say that, well, they're not 3D and it might be possible that major parts of the code should be rewritten, so who knows how it will go, but let's not get too much excited about these things, but I gotta say, they do look pretty good and I think there is interest from the developers to bring them back in the following or next one Plasma releases. Also, the QML porting might mean, in my opinion, and I hope I'm right here, that we could get some more activity on the get third party uh, switchers as well because right now you cannot install any third party C++ thingy at all but if we do see a rise in QML stuff that's way more easy to actually let the user install you can see that there's already this button down right uh, for some reason it doesn't work for me I think it's my Wi-Fi that's not working today but anyhow I hope that this new QML thingy will bring more users into actually trying to write some pretty switches and of course all of the code of all of these things will be open source so anybody can take a look and try to replicate the major functionalities while maybe trying out a new look who knows also i want to say that just to say how cool plasma customization is you can actually customize what you want to see in the switcher so you can see only windows from this virtual desktop or all virtual desktops or all other virtual desktops here if you're into that you can also filter by activity which is the default but also by screen and so on so you can actually select all of the combinations of filters that you might that you might be interested and i think that's pretty cool like i didn't know about it you learn new stuff every day i guess and you can do that so i was impressed by it so to recap cool new effects coming cool things that were already there and i just discovered and maybe i'll do like a tips and tricks video about those things if i discover more and that's it see you soonish next week So, I mean, basically we are rewriting, basically we are redesigning the way that our KWIN desktop works. 
Basically, we are redesigning the way that our KWIN window, Windows effects work. Now, as there are some minor issues with, uh, you know, in just 